back, ladies and gentlemen. And of course, I'm now delighted to be joined by Now TV senior correspondent Tagreed Hussein, who attended the seventh three-way summit between Egyptian and Cypriot and Greek leaders. Tagreed, can you hear us? Yes, dear. It's good a very good you. afternoon to you, Tagreed. Uh, of course, uh, the uh, press conference held uh, the three-way summit uh, between the Egyptian, Cypriot, and uh, uh, Greek leadership was a very important indication on the ties between the three countries and the importance of the relations between the three countries. What can you tell us uh, stood out most uh, in the discussions and the conference that you attended? Uh, Angie, a very important meeting, Egypt hosting the seventh tripartite summit with Cyprus and Greece on Tuesday, yes. discussing common key challenges. The summit was headed by His Excellency President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi in the presence of the Cypriot President Nikos Anastasiadis and the Greek Prime Minister Kyriakos Mitsukatis. Yes. The summit is the seventh gathering the leaders of the three countries since 2014. As you know, in May 2018, an Egyptian-Greek Cypriot summit was held back in Athens. Mm -hmm. The timing also, Angie, is very crucial in yes. light of the latest developments in the eastern Mediterranean region. Mm -hmm. uh, during the summit, the three leaders had signed bilateral and trilateral investment agreements. They also stressed on the importance of cooperation between neighboring countries as a cornerstone of stability in the eastern Mediterranean region. Uh, earlier, as you know, on Thursday, Turkey announced that it had sent a drilling ship to waters of southern Cyprus, where Greek Cypriot authorities had awarded hydrocarbon exploration rights to Italian and French companies. So uh, definitely the summit also uh, uh, tackled the Turkish aggression. Mm -hmm. uh, the summit started with His Excellency President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi asserting that it gives him a great pleasure to welcome the leaders in Egypt and talked about the strong trilateral cooperation in the different domains and talked about the consultations and how a number of joint programs are there in the field of investment and also how they tackle challenges facing the Middle East, the Middle East region and talked about the file of combating uh, terrorism. They talked also illegal migration and the reaching a political solution in Libya, which is considered essential. Mm -hmm. Also uh, facing any sort uh, of uh, developments, uh, they talked the Syrian file developments on the Syrian front. On the Palestinian issue, the Palestinians should regain their legitimate rights uh, which is establishing an independent Palestinian state with Jerusalem as its capital. Yes. Uh, achieving peace and security is a priority, President Sisi affirmed, mm -hmm. in their trilateral cooperation. The president thanked the leaders for their keenness on further boosting this strong uh, trilateral cooperation. And the Cypriot president, on his behalf, thanked President Sisi and stated that we're looking to further cooperation uh, with Egypt. And he stated that they talked uh, very important files at this important visit, defense, interior, energy, and also environmental uh, preservation. They also talked about the, uh, combating uh, illegal migration. Yes. And they also talked climate change, which is considered to be also very important. Mm -hmm. uh, they tackled the Libyan files, the Palestinian question. They also talked about uh, the uh, developments vis-a-vis uh, -vis facing the Turkish aggression, the unacceptable unilateral steps yes. on behalf of Turkey that threatens the eastern Mediterranean stability. Mm -hmm. uh, the president of Cyprus said that the Cypriot people admire Egypt's stance and Greece to support Cyprus and said that we condemn the Turkish aggressive steps. The Cypriots admire Egypt and Greece's supporting to the file, safeguarding their national security. Yes. And the political will and determination is definitely there, as the president of Cyprus also said, that this would really help further our uh, trilateral cooperation. Once again, he thanked uh, the president, President Sisi, for the warm welcome and the hospitality mm -hmm. that he and the delegation received here in Egypt. And he said that we are looking forward to the eighth summit in Cyprus. On his behalf, uh, the Greek Prime Minister said that the trilateral cooperation is very strong 
and thank President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi for this important opportunity to share and asserted that Egypt is not only a friend but a strong heavyweight country in the region that has a very important role to play and cited the important roles played by Egypt uh, in the OIC and also in Africa as Egypt chairs the African Union 2019. Yes. He, he talked about Egypt as a very important and effective partner in the fight against uh, terror and said that Egypt throughout history has a very rich culture and has also a very rich Greek community. Mm-hmm. So uh, definitely where uh, he said Egypt is a great, this is a great bridge, that great community of communication between the two people mm-hmm. and uh, stated also more about signing agreements at this uh, seventh important summit and said that I wish to invite the two presidents to visit Athens in 2020 and talked about also uh, the very important initiative cultural wise that yes. would uh, uh, also foster communication and people to people relations which as you remember the roots uh, revival or yes. the Nostos. Back to the Roots Program. Yes. yes, the Roots Program, that was also a very important uh, issue. Um, uh, mind you, Angie, that the cooperation mechanism between the three countries is a very solid and strategic foundation in the region. And definitely it reflects the leader's sincere desire to move forward mm-hmm. with this strong and long partnership that is based not only on the realities of the geographical proximity, but also on the historical legacy and also on the common cultural divide. So uh, they meet on one important file, uh, on efforts of combating terrorism. The Egyptian-Greek Cypriot uh, tripartite or trilateral summit would always represent the invincible fortress in the face of the escalating challenges. First and foremost comes the expansion of any sort of extremism and terrorism. Uh, also cooperation in the field not only of combating terrorism but you have also diplomatically and politically you have climate change which is also a very important uh, sector following uh, the initiatives that has been uh, undertaken by the president of Cyprus and the Egyptian government during the United Nations Climate Action Summit in New York and Egypt today is attaching great attention uh, to uh, climate change formulating a comprehensive strategy addressing the threats of climate change and preventing their impact on the people and the environment is high on the foreign policy agendas uh, of the three uh, countries. NG. Yes. Now TV senior correspondent Tagrit Hussein, thank you very much for joining us and uh, for your very comprehensive uh, reporting. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we do wrap up our special edition, but do stay tuned for more coming your way on Now TV International.